Hello and welcome. This is Kushbu Bhatta and today you will learn how you can automatically send WhatsApp messages when you receive a new form submission in Motic. Suppose your company received a customer response on Motic regarding registration or subscription and you have to acknowledge that response by sending them a WhatsApp message. So, how will you do it? Basically, there are two ways. First, you go to Motic, get all the customer details and the response details, come back, compose a message and send it to every single customer via WhatsApp. However, this can be time consuming. So what to do? Don't worry, we have the Pavli Smart way. Here we will integrate Motic with WhatsApp all using Pavli Connect. So when you receive a new form submission in Motic, your customers will automatically receive a WhatsApp message. Come with me to see how we do it. To send WhatsApp message on new form submission on Motic, let us first go to Pabli's website. On the top right, you will see two options, sign up free and sign in. Since I already have an account, I will just sign in. Let us now go to Pabli Connect. On the top right, you will see a create workflow button. Click there. It will ask you to name it. I will simply write Motic to WhatsApp, create, alright, so it will show you two windows, trigger and action, trigger means when this happens, action says do this, so here we will select Motic, So why we are selecting this new form entry as a trigger event? Because we want every time a new form is submitted on Motic, a message is to be sent from WhatsApp to the user. Let us select new form entry as trigger event. So a webhook URL will appear. A webhook URL is basically a link that connects two applications. Let us copy this. And now go to Motic's page. The dashboard is here. On the top right corner, you will see settings. Click there. Come down, you will see webhooks. And on the top, top right hand side, you will see new button. Click there. Name it. We will simply write Motic WhatsApp. Yes. Now webhook description, it is up to you. I am leaving it empty. Here in the webhook post URL, let us copy this URL from Pabli's page and now paste this here. Now come to the webhook events on the right hand side. Select form submit event. Now to the right corner, click on yes, then apply. Let's go to Pabli's page and see what's happening. Okay, yeah, it is still waiting for a webhook response. So now let us go and go to Motic and fill a dummy form. So to see if Pabli is able to capture the data. So I created a dummy here. Let us fill in these details. So we have filled in the sample form. Let us submit. All right, the details are submitted. Let us go to Pabli's page and see if it has received the information. Yes, it says response received and here you can see all the details. The first name Ashok Dummy, Dummy is the last name Ashok Dummy. We have the details like email address and the mobile number. All right, so it is that means we have successfully connected Motic with Pabli. Now let us go to action window and select WhatsApp Cloud API. Select send template message as the action event. Connect. Add new connection. All right, it will ask you a few details here. For this, let us go to developers Facebook page. On the top, on the left hand side, you will see WhatsApp option. Drop down will appear. Click there. Getting started. And here you will see these keys. So this is the temporary access token key. Copy this. Come back to Babylis page. Paste the key. Again, we will go to developers page. 
here you will see the phone number id copy this then let us paste it here again go to the developers page and you will see whatsapp business account id copy this come back paste it and save okay now it will ask you for few details this is the template name we will go to we created a template on whatsapp that is the message that would be sent to the users so this is form submission we have selected now let us give some more details it is asking for recipient mobile number let us map that from motic go down down and down down you will see here it is then in the body field it will ask you the name again we will map, map it from motic okay here you will see the first name then give a space and we will now map the last name come down and down here it is click on this now just save and send test request okay so the response has been received now let us go to users whatsapp and see if they have actually received our message and here you can see thank you for filling up the form welcome to pabli i hope this video was useful for you for more such videos you can subscribe to our channel on youtube